Yeah, today we're going um, to do some testing in the wind tunnel. After being on the track, um, we found out some things and, and uh, now we're going to try to check that if that worked better and, and also we did some adjustments on, on the suits and um, also on the position and um, so yeah. started yet so no I'm, I'm excited to be here and um, we're gonna start with some testing the wheels the, all the different um, rim heights um, to see you know what the difference is and so I can really you know pick what I feel like the most comfortable with but also how I can be the, the fastest with <music> My name is Alex, I'm the road marketing manager for DT Swiss and today we are here in the GST wind tunnel in Imagestadt. Um, this is basically where we do all the aero testing of our wheels and for sure together with our athletes. Yeah, hi, I'm Jean-Paul from Swissside. Today we've been testing in the wind tunnel with Daniela Reef, uh, looking for performance. Uh, the reason we test in the wind tunnel as well as on the velodrome is for two reasons. Firstly, we can measure a lot more accurately in the wind tunnel, so we can really look for these fine adjustments. Uh, secondly, in the wind tunnel, we can also uh, simulate crosswinds, which is really important for uh, tracks like Kona or, or any real-world tracks uh, for, that, for that instance. Today, we've been working a lot with, uh, in particular, uh, helmets and bottles and bottle position. Um, and uh, right at the end, we we're also testing different head positions, and we found some, some really big gains, actually. Uh, for Daniela, so she's going to walk out of here today uh, with uh, not just a handful of watts but also a handful of minutes which are going to make her uh, quite a bit faster in Kona this year. Been quite a big improvement on some details. Uh, I think uh, it was very interesting also to test the, the race suit again, which we, from the first, from the being on a track, we adjusted again. And it's just, it's a lot of things that just get confirmed. And, and um, depending on the bike also, you know, it's not all the bikes are the same. So I think um, the felt bike is already quite a wide bike with, with a big um, sailing effect. So it's definitely good to know that now we, um, yeah, we have the things at the right place and um, I think we could make a step forward today again. Over the world.